of course Memorial Day, but preparations for the day's remembrances are already well underway. KTV News Watch 7's John Oki shows us one group's efforts to make sure one of Omaha's largest cemeteries is ready. Anywhere. Because we're going to do this, this, this. An operation like this requires military precision. 100 okay. flags in a bucket, and there's another bucket down there. And there's another bucket down in the end. The mission? To search through over 59,000 graves and mark every veteran buried in West Lawn Hillcrest with an American flag. Seven years ago, we started about 2,000 flags, and now we've uh, moved up to almost 6,000 flags. They try not to miss a single grave. The cemetery has uh, veterans from the Civil War, Spanish American War. World War I, II, all the way up through Afghanistan, Iraq. The Centennial Lodge of the Freemasons is marshalling the troops needed to get the job done, and these troops are committed. They died in service of our country, and we'd like to remember them. Bonnie DeWilde and her mother are working one section. It's very sobering as you look around to see all these flags. BJ and Bonnie already have two service members in their family. A third plans to join up soon. As they walk the course, those family members are on their minds. It rings very close to home. It's more personal than it's ever been. By the time Memorial Day dawns, hundreds of volunteers working in shifts will have covered the entire cemetery, an effort that they say is well worth it. If we didn't have flags here, we might not remember the sacrifice that these people have given to their country. In Omaha, John Oki, KETV, Newswatch 7. Now, the organizers wish all the cemeteries in Omaha would get the same treatment. They're calling on other groups to step forward.